have heard from many players that they are getting the annoying Roblox crash error. The full error message says, an unanticipated error has happened and Roblox needs to close. We apologize. This error message usually shows up in Roblox Studio, but it could also appear when you try to load a game. If you can't get the game to load in Roblox Studio or it crashes after you've played for a while, Make sure your PC's software environment is up to date. This means checking to see if there are any new versions of the following. Game client. Graphics card drivers. Windows operating system. In rare cases, the crash could be caused by a game client that has just been updated. In this case, you should try going back to the game's previous version. If you've updated everything and Roblox is still crashing, you can try removing the game completely. To do this, you need to do two things. First, you can uninstall the game and then delete the folder called App Data. Follow these steps to get rid of Roblox. Click the Start button. Click Settings. Select Apps. Click Apps and Features. Find the Roblox Player application and click Uninstall. Click Uninstall again to confirm. If you have Windows 8 or an older version of Windows, you might want to use the control panel to go to Settings and uninstall Roblox instead. After you delete the game, you need to delete the Roblox app data folder. This is how. Click the Start button. Once the Start menu is pulled up, type in percent of data. Select the app data file folder. Select Local. Find the Roblox folder and right click on it. Select Delete. After removing Roblox, you can reinstall it to see if the error is gone and if it now works correctly. If Roblox still gives you the same error after it has crashed, you can try updating some files in the installation folder as a last resort. You'll have to do this once you've downloaded it. You'll need a special tool like WinRAR or something similar to get to the files inside. There should be three. Then, open the installation folder, which is where your Roblox files are, and paste the three files you downloaded there. If you have a shortcut to Roblox on your desktop, you can open the installation folder by right-clicking on the icon and choosing Open File Location. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it if you can leave a like, subscribe to our channel, or share this video to your friends. This can greatly help in making sure that Google's algorithm can find and recommend this video to others.